there is one super rare mob that was added to the game and that is the blue axolotl there is only a 0.08 percent chance for one of these to spawn and if you guys are a fan of wadzi's hardcore series like i am you guys must know that he got two of the rarest axolotls so in this video i decided to one up wadzi and capture more than two of the blue axolotls and before we begin i just want to quickly announce that my brand new merch collection is finally out i love how this collection turned out especially the brown hoodies and the accessories i literally use the phone case and the mug every single day so if you guys would like to support me and be a part of the cookie army go check out the first link below thank you guys so much for all of the support i love all of you guys anyways this is episode four of my hardcore series i hope you guys enjoy I just realized I'm eating bread instead of eating these potatoes that I made. I made this giant potato farm and I eat bread instead. What is wrong with me? Uh, welcome to episode four. The world is looking pretty snazzy. I've never said that word before. Why, why did I even say that? I got the potato farm. The village is nice and protected. A sheep farm right here. My beautiful looking home. An egg just sitting here. I have no idea how I got there. Probably that chicken over there. And these bad boys. I haven't fed them in a while, so they're probably starving out here. But I think this episode, I want to aim for uh, getting a blue axolotl. Yes. the rarest one possible it's like a 0.08 percent chance i think so it might take me a couple hours or even a couple days to find it but that is the main goal and i'm sorry if i sound a little weird right now i was uh i lost my voice a little bit so it's <laughs> i can't talk i lost my voice last night and i'm just trying my best to speak right now it sounds like my nose is plugged or something but anyways i'm gonna spend some time lighting up these rooftops on top of these village houses because i think mobs are spawning on top of them like zombies and then they're jumping down and attacking all of the villagers so i'm gonna spend some time to light up all of these uh, little nooks and crannies up here. All right, I think I lit up every single roof on top of every home in the village now. So hopefully no mobs will be coming inside here. I think it'll be all safe for the villagers. But I got a butt ton of iron golems now just protecting the land. Even this guy out here, he's just killing everybody. Let's go. One day I'm going to have to make an iron farm out of these villagers though. Get an unlimited supply of iron. That'd be great. All right, but I think it's going to take a pretty long time to find a blue axolotl somewhere. So I'm going to start early and go searching for an axolotl. Actually, let me head back. I, I need one thing, actually. Skirt! Ugh, oh my god, my voice. It hurts to speak. I forgot my... Where is it? Hello? Oh, there it is. Hold up. I had diamond tools the entire time? Oh my god, what am I doing using iron tools? I totally forgot I made diamond tools. What am I doing? But I did find my spot glass I was looking for. So let's hop back into my boat. Yeet. Oh, I missed my boat. Yeet. And let's go find this blue axolotl. This might take a couple days. If you guys watched Wadzi's video he found it within like the first five seconds of his video but knowing my luck it's probably gonna take me like five episodes but i gotta keep my eyes peeled and once i get the blue axolotl i'm gonna make him a special home right beside all of the normal axolotls to show them who is the king and who is the boss all right let's stop right here let's take a look any uh, axolotls i see with my very eyes um no i just see water Ooh, what is happening over there that's a all right kids can't see that all right i think i'm gonna head back to my base over here because before there was a lot of oh i was right there's a lot of axolotls that spawn right near my base so i'm gonna keep searching around to find this blue axolotl i don't think i'm ever gonna find it all right let's dive in we got my bucket ready that's a pink one i do not see any oh yellow another cyan go i got my head in this little air bubble <laughs> trying to breathe another oh every time i see a cyan axolotl i think it's the blue one every single time it looks so similar of course minecraft made a cyan one. Oh, i just killed the bat the bat just took the bullet for the zombie but of course, Minecraft made a sign one to look like the rare blue one to just get us like super. Oh my, how's a skeleton in there? I'm actually gonna grab two doors because I keep like suffocating and drowning in the water. Whoa, whoa, is that one? Oh my God, that's another sign one. There's a yellow one killing these squids. Oh my God, the squid is like twice your size. Come on, kill the axolotl. The squids are like twice the size of an axolotl and it still dies from it. That was kind of sad. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, I was suffocated right there. I'm a soggy cookie now. I'm getting kind of moist. That does not sound right to say. <laughs> I should just stop talking. Everything I say just turns out sounding sus. All right, I'm having no luck finding the blue axolotl by my house. So I think I'm going to travel away maybe like another 5,000 block and see if the blue axolotl is hiding from me. Time to go on a long journey. 
Yo, I just found a sick ocean monument right by land. I've never seen that before. I usually see them like super deep into the ocean, like in the middle of nowhere. I've never seen it on like the stilts to the little pillars. That is so weird. Well, I haven't really seen a lot of ocean monuments before. I've never even really been inside one, but uh, it looks pretty cool. Yo, did that squid just get zapped? Is Aquaman in there? Atlantis? Oh, I should make Atlantis right here. That's so sick. This ocean monument spawned right beside land. That is so weird. It's literally like a couple blocks away. Okay, I'm definitely gonna have to save this spot. And try oh, oh my god, I'm out of here. The jump scared me. What the? I was not expecting that. Oh my god, my heart actually jumped out of my butthole. Oh my god. The hair of my arms is standing up. Okay, but as I was saying, I think I'm gonna save this spot right here. And one day, I'm gonna transform it into Atlantis. I'm gonna make a city underwater. But let's keep exploring for a spot that will have axolotls. How about right here? Come on, come on, come on. All right, nope. It is dry. Well, I'm in the ocean. I guess it's not really dry, but you guys know what I mean. Come on, there has to be one here. Okay, that's a cyan one, a brown one. That's just a normal fish. Oh my god, where are the blue ones? Ooh, we found glow squid, though. This guy's in the wall. I can't even hit him. Okay, he's out. And he didn't even drop anything. Nice. On to the next spot. Ooh, the sunken ship right here, though. It looks pretty intact and not really damaged at all. All right, let's see what's inside these chests here. Oh, I have a mining fatigue for a minute, bro. Oh my god, looks like I'm AFK here for a minute. Day two. All right, I was actually gone for more than uh, one minute. I wanted to go get a snack like usual. I ate like a whole box of Pringles or well, a whole can. Well, what's inside this chest? Some lapis, one piece of iron, some gold, and some M meats. Not too bad. There should be another chest in here, but it won't be as good as the treasure chest. Over here, buried treasure. Ooh, okay. Maybe that will lead me to the blue axolotl. Oh, oh my God, this one's full. I got moss blocks. Let's go. I can actually use this moss block to make a moss biome. I think the only other way to get moss blocks is from a wandering trader. So that is actually really good. I'm actually quite happy with the loot I got, but let's see where this buried treasure is. Um, I have no idea what it means when I'm in the corner of the map. Does it mean I'm too far away or something? Let's boat around and see. Ow, 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 what? what just hit me? What just poisoned me? What the heck? What was in this kelp? I'm getting jump scared by everything in Minecraft right now. It's a block game. I'm a child. Is it bad that I have no idea how to read this map? Why am I in the corner? Why am I not moving? Am I too far away? I literally have two brain cells. I can't even read a Minecraft map. All right, I have no idea how to use this. Go back in the water. <laughs> Soon that will be the buried treasure right there. No more distractions. Time to get back to finding this axolotl. Holy cow! What is that? Is that a shrine to the heavens? Why is it so tall? Oh my lord. I've never seen Minecraft generate like this. What is happening? Hello? Am I in the alien world right now? There's one, two, three floating stone island thingies. What the? This is the weirdest world generation I've ever seen. Whoa, this is sick. This actually looks like an actual place in real life. I have no idea where, but it looks like a real place. That sounds so stupid what I just said. But it looks real. Oh, I see some ice logs down there. Oh, I'm coming in. Oh, they tried hiding. I saw them going back. I'm coming back. I'm coming for you guys. Where? Oh, hello, buddy. Show me show me your blue friend. Where's he at? Yeah, lead me lead me to him. All right, no, no. You can't do a U-turn like that. I know he's hiding in here. I know he's here. That, that, that pink axolotl is acting super sus back there. Imagine he actually is here. That'd be crazy. All right, never mind. Just a dead end, I think. Oh, that sucks. Oh, oh, is that it? Wait, wait. Oh, oh, don't kill it. Don't kill it. Is that it? No, that's a sign one, right? Oh, he's frozen. He's frozen. Hello? Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. No way. Is that actually the blue axolotl? I'm gonna die. Ah, protect me. Oh, my God. God, the healing power of friendship. Oh, he gave me regeneration. Oh, he's my boy. He's my boy. Where'd he, where'd he go? Where'd he, where'd he go? Oh, that, that's the blue one, right? That has to be the blue one. He looks pretty blue. He doesn't look that cyan. Oh my God. No way. Come here. Yes. Oh, yes. Yes. Hold up. We need to inspect him. We got to take a closer look because the blue one and the cyan one looks really similar. Oh, that that's definitely the blue one. The cyan one looks ugly. This one's actually cute. Let's go. That's a 0.08% chance of finding it. Oh my God. Thank you so much to that pink axolotl that led me to him. He tried hiding and he tried tried doing like a Tokyo Drift 360 and turn around from the cave. I can't believe he actually led me to the blue axolotl. Let's go find that pink axolotl and thank him. Where is he? Is he still in here in this cave? I don't see him. That should hurt my voice a lot. Screaming about the axolotl. I'm screaming about pixels in Minecraft. Oh my god, I'm getting a little too old for this. All right, I think the pink one is gone. He's hiding. He doesn't want to be uh, seen anymore after he revealed the blue axolotl. Have you guys ever watched How to Train Your Dragon? And like, uh, what's his name? Hiccup? Hiccup shot down the uh, Night Fury and the Night Fury is like a super rare that no one has ever seen before. That's what I just felt like. I felt like I was Hiccup and I found the blue axolotl and I found the Night Fury. I'm gonna name this guy Toothless. I'm actually a child. I'm playing Minecraft as I talk about a cartoon from Pixar. I'm actually a child. <laughs> 
someone must relate though someone must know what i'm talking about let me know in the comments if you guys watched how to train your dragon all right but let's boat all the way back home and make a special little enclosure for this blue axolotl because he's so rare i'm gonna be honest i have no idea if i'm even going the right way i'm just holding w and on my phone <laughs> i'm not even looking where i'm going so i might be going off to narnia at this point let's just let's just hope i'm going the right way all right yeah maybe i should have looked at my coordinates before just boating off because i boated 3,000 blocks too far Ooh, hey at least i found a desert biome what the heck what is wrong with my world generation i found a floating little platform in the water in the ocean what i've never seen this before either has anyone ever seen this before in minecraft a floating little platform in the ocean oh some glow squids nice what is going on today everything's so weird right now all right i finally made it home that took so long hello you're kidding me there's absolutely no shot no chance there's no chance i just got home from my like 4,000 block exploration to find this thing and there's another blue one right beside my house there's no shot there's no way okay i quickly i'll get a bucket that has to be a sign one today is just a crazy day oh my god look at the amount of axolotls down there there's so many there's a pink one. Oh, that has to be the blue one there was a yellow one over there okay let's no waste no time i'm wasting time right now am i the first ever person to find two blue axolotls in one video okay let's quickly grab a bucket grab that go 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 go. there's no way go 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 please don't despawn on me where is he oh no where is he oh no that guy just did a nice little hop oh he's right there i thought i lost him okay is it is it him no, that's a sign one. Where did the blue one go? Oh, he's hiding from me. No, no, it has to be here somewhere. There's no way it despawned. I'm gonna be like the first person to find two, literally in a row. Come on, it has to be here. There's no way it despawned. Come on, is it here? Is it that guy? If it's a sign one again, I'm punching my screen. Come on, come on, come on. That's the sign one. Probably the same exact one. Where did he go? Please. I want to be famous. I want to find two axolotls. The yellow one's right there. No, I think I lost them, boys. I think I lost them. Oh, is he down there? Oh no, that's another sign one. I think let's let's dive down for a closer look a brown one a yellow one come on there's no no way he's definitely hiding here somewhere he knows i'm coming for him oh oh, oh i'm gonna suffocate okay all right i'm gonna spend the next couple of minutes trying to find this guy all right, I'm going to spend the next couple of hours trying to find this guy because there's no way I'm missing out on another blue axolotl. And after spending about 15 minutes searching around the caves, I honestly thought I lost a blue axolotl. And I was quite sad. Finding two blue axolotls with a 0.08% chance would be insane for one episode. But you won't believe what happened next. Oh, holy crap. How did he get here? There's a drown with a trident. Oh, I'm going to die. There's a drown here with a trident. Holy God, there's a lot of damage. Oh, did I get it? Oh, I got it. I got his trident. It's actually like pretty much full durability too nice oh there he is where, where'd he go oh he's he's waiting right beside my house oh i think he wants me i found him i found him again he was oh yes i got him he was right beside my house yes oh my god i got two of them now okay i thought i lost him i spent so long trying to search for him inside those caves and he turned out to be right here by my house waiting for me oh let's go i got two. Oh, let's go okay i got two blue axolotls should i put them in there in the cage with all the normal axolotls i feel like the these guys will fight i don't know why i feel like these guys are like the special axolotls that shouldn't be with the normal guys let me let me see if they will fight let me put them in there let's put both of them yes i got two. Oh, they they stand out so much they're so cute oh my god that is amazing that has to go into the record books or something all right but i'm gonna collect these axolotls because i don't want them to be in the cage full of peasants because these guys are the king and queens and i'm gonna make them a separate home over here by my house or something all right i'm gonna put them securely in this one barrel right here so they don't escape but i might have to be the first ever youtuber to get three or more blue axolotls because i have to one up wadzi and i can't just stick with two i'm gonna be completely honest with you guys i really don't want to go out there and find another blue axolotl it took me like a couple of hours to find those two but i'm gonna have to do it to one up wadzi but before i do that i'm gonna start building my new home for the rare axolotls and i have a pretty sick idea for their home my idea is to expand this dock right here all the way out into the water so it goes along on the coast here and i will have like a little crane thing that will hold a cage that like collects the fish in the water and that cage will have the two blue axolotls inside if that made any sense to anybody i'm sure nobody understood what i just said so i'm gonna show you guys by building it i'm gonna need a lot of spruce wood to expand the dock all the way along this coast and i just ran out oh actually i did not run out there's one extra one that i just picked up now, now I ran out. So let's run over here with my trusty diamond axe and start destroying this forest. Ha <laughs> ha! 
Back to mining trees. What the heck is this fox doing? Is he hunting for fish? What is he doing? Do fox eat fish? Oh, he does have fish in his mouth. What is he doing though? I didn't know fox eat fishes. This whole episode is so weird. I've never seen a fox swim before chasing fish in the water. What is happening? Look, look how much fish is in here too. It's all cod. Maybe my brain is just tripping right now. I just wiped out the entire forest though, except for this tree right here, kind of in the middle. <laughs> Feels kind of bad, but hey, I need it for my dock, which is more important than trees no nah, i'm just kidding trees are important guys save the environment save it any other way than cutting trees though because i need my trees <laughs> you guys remember in elementary when they would give you like a little seed or a little sapling in real life and they would make you plant it in your front yard has anyone done that before because i planted mine in the front yard and the tree is ginormous now they gave me like a little pine tree when i was just a kid and now the tree is pretty big i'm pretty sure it's like taller than me now i try to put a photo on the screen if i'm uh, not lazy to go outside and take a picture of my tree let me know in the comments if you guys did that too i always thought it was pretty cool though because it's like a milestone as a kid kind of thing and like the tree grows up with you as you grow up you know until the tree grows too tall and taller than you and then you feel sad because like you're just so short yeah maybe just maybe that's just a me problem all right but i got a whole bunch of wood here and a lot of saplings that i probably won't use at all so i'm gonna turn these into spruce planks here and make a whole bunch of slabs and bam that should be enough for the entire dock and let's get right back into building Oh, the boss is back. The boss has gold armor and a shovel again. Oh, we gotta kill him. Here we go. Oh, we got some gold armor though. Every single episode, the boss just gets harder and harder. <laughs> all right, I made a pretty long dock all the way throughout here. So now I can finally have a walkway to my axolotl farm and a walkway over to my potato farm, which is really nice. I don't need to walk through this grass all the time. And I think I did a pretty good job making this curve. Look at look at this nice little curve right here. It took like a shoom. Like that sound effect. Shoom. All right, but now let's make the axolotl actual dock that goes out into the water so i think i'm gonna make it around like right over here so let's make it like five blocks long like this i think would be good and now let's expand it all the way out into the ocean and then i can build a boat beside it and the crane that will catch all the fish and that will be my axolotl home i'm sure none of you guys understand what i'm building so you will see in a second all right there we go i think i'm gonna make it a little bit longer though but that's what it's gonna look like and i might make a giant ship right here in the future for another video right beside this dock i think that'll be pretty cool but yeah let's get right back into building all right i made it pretty long it's pretty long you know what else is long my toes anyways let's start working on the platform that will hold the crane that will be my axolotl home so let's make it a little bit elevated right here just like that and let's make it like a little square all right i ended up having to move the entire platform like 10 blocks that way because i didn't like how close this was to the middle and it would end up blocking the view of my house so i had to destroy the entire thing and move it over here but the thing is in a good spot now and this part right here will hold the crane and i have no idea how to build the crane i maybe built one crane once in like 2016 or something so i'm gonna grab some resources and try my best all right i got all of my materials i think i need and let's start designing this thing so i'm gonna make a big pillar right here just like that All right, so this is the support beam that will carry the crane. And I'm just going to add some signs around here to uh, just make the uh, support beam look a little fancier. If I could click the done button. And I'll make it go all the way around, all the way up to the top. All right, so now I'm going to start working on the actual crane portion. And this might be quite hard to build because I haven't really built a crane before. So let's just uh, try it out and see how it looks. That isn't too bad right there. So on this side, this will have the little cage for the axolotls. And over here, I'll probably have like a little weight to like counteract the weight on the axolotl in the water. If that makes any sense. I should probably, I, I suck at explaining things. I'll just show you guys my building. I'll just shut up at this point.
All right, I think I got the crane design finished. I think it looks pretty good. I'm just bridge out here quickly for you guys. So this is the crane. Over here, we'll hold the cage. And down here, we'll hold the little weight to counteract the weight. I put some fences here. I added some fences on the top to give it like a reinforced look. And some signs here. Add some like connection points or something. And some trap door just to, you know, I don't know. It just looks good. Oh my God, my throat hurts. I'm so dedicated to make this video for you guys. My throat is killing me. I have tea right beside me but don't worry guys i'll get the video out to you all right i added a little weight portion right here and i think i'm going to use a mix of basalt and amethyst as the weight just because it looks cool and it kind of looks like heavy you know like it's a mineral and both of them are like heavy looking minerals or something and the platform just like that and i cannot forget torches just in case you know mob spawn there all right so now we got the weight finished that will counteract the weight over here oh creepy creeper oh no please don't blow up go away let the big reveal there it is i got the little glass cage finished and the weight and the huge crane i think it looks all right but all i gotta do now is put water in there and throw my axolotls in the glass cage and they will have their new home all right so let's grab my two axolotls luckily they haven't escaped and hopefully they're still alive in this bucket let's head on up there oh speed bridge it up and we are at the top now let's fill this place with some water here now we are ready to put the axolotls in their new home one blue axolotl and the second blue axolotl the king and the queen what should we name them guys put some names in the comments should we put king william and queen Brittany? let me know some awesome names in the comments oh are they escaping could they escape through this trap door hopefully they can't all right but let's take a look from the outside i'm really excited to see how this looks because this took me a very long time to build and this was actually like my second time building it because the first time i actually forgot to record so i basically had to build this two times so let's take my spyglass out and take a look oh yes their home looks amazing let's go now that is a fancy home for axolotls there's nothing boring like a glass cage like that it's actually a nice looking crane on this dock in the ocean oh yeah i'm pretty impressed i'm pretty impressed it looks like they're enjoying their stay too and let's take a look from this side over here because you can see the farm and the house oh that is amazing right there we got the crane the farm windmill right there and my house and the village over over there this hardcore world is getting pretty nice we're making a lot of progress all right but like i promised i have to find another blue axolotl i said i was the first youtuber to get two axolotls in a video but wadzi actually beat me to the punch and now i'm gonna have to one up wadzi and go exploring for a second not a second i'm gonna have to go exploring for a third blue axolotl and like i said before it is a 0.08 percent chance of finding one so this might take me a whole nother day i do see some axolotls down here though so let's just pray one of them is blue, yellow, some two pink ones. And I don't see any more. But I'm dedicated. I have to find another one. So let's go exploring. And after an entire real life day of exploring the entire ocean, different types of caves, and so many different mountains and biomes, I even ran across some ocean monuments. I finally ran into my third axolotl. Oh my god, I found I found my third one. Finally. That was a whole day later. Oh my god. I finally found one after like going through at least a thousand axolotls finally at first i looked down there and i thought that was the blue one and then i unscoped from my spyglass and he was like right there oh my god <sighs> that took so long oh my god okay mission accomplished i got my third axolotl now let's head home i am only four thousand blocks away from home right now oh this is gonna be a long trip all right i finally made it home imagine i find another blue axolotl in one of these reviews right by my base i swear my base is like lucky or something yeah i see a lot of axolotls down here I see two pinks one yellow um i don't see anything else i think they might be hiding in between these caves but i always get pretty lucky in here i see a brown one right underneath right under right under me um yeah i do not see any blue ones though All right, i didn't get crazy lucky this time but look at my crane it looks pretty awesome i got two of my blue axolotls up there skirt and let's place the third one in there let's build up here and now i have officially one upped wadzi he had two blue axolotls and now i have three of the rarest axolotls in minecraft each one of these guys is a 0.083 percent chance of spawning and i actually got all three of them which took me three to four real life days by the way this took a really long time all right but now that i have the three rarest axolotls in minecraft and probably the first youtuber to have three i'm gonna try to breed them because if you could breed two blue axolotls and it will poop out i'm gonna be kind of upset that i spent an 
an entire day searching for this guy. So let's go get some tropical fish from the ocean. Hide your kids, hide your wife, hide your kids, hide your wife. Stealing all them fishies. Give me that snatch. Do another quick bing bong uh, speed bridge here. Jump inside. These guys are trying to escape too. I guess they don't like their home too much. Maybe because I made these out of trap doors and they're trying to get out. But now that I have tropical fish, let's try to breed them. So right click this guy and right click this guy. Okay, they're going to make some... Um... Okay, they're not making love. They're uh, headbutting the walls. Um, what is going on? What are they doing? <laughs> what is happening? Let's right click one of the other guys. Oh, this guy's out. Oh my god, these guys are escaping. These guys really want to come out. Nani? Oh, oh my god. No way. You're no shot. You're lying. You're lying. You're lying. Oh my god, you could breathe them. You could breathe them. I have four blue axolotls. I have four of them. Oh my god, you're telling me I spent an entire day searching for a blue axolotl when you could just breathe them now. Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna have infinite blue axolotls now. Well, there you guys have it. I have four blue axolotls. Well, I guess you can say I'm the YouTuber with the most rarest axolotls now. Kind of an achievement. Unless there's someone out there that have more than me. Let me know in the comments if there is. Are right, now that I completed the main objective of the entire video i'm gonna finish off this dock here so i'm gonna add some support beams into the water and finish it off with some fences so let's get building i just had the biggest voice crack but don't blame me guys all right after spending way too much time building i finally completed the dock fully that took quite a long time but i think it looks quite well i've never said it like that that sounds so proper <laughs> but i think it looks pretty good i got the support beams all the way in the water i stripped off the wood so it matches with the theme of the entire world i got some trap doors just to add some little touch some buttons up here and some fences to surround all of the docks so i don't fall into the water and drown but yeah that took quite a long time but overall i think the entire place looks pretty pretty good especially with the crane and the axolotls in there but the crane looks pretty good but you know what will make it look a lot better say it with me guys leaves oh wait i only have 26 i'm not complaining though this is my favorite part of minecraft cheering leaves the sound of money and let's cover it up with some leaves and i don't really want to add too much leaves this time because like usually i do add a whole bunch of leaves but the crane is pretty small and i don't want to cover up the beautiful look of it because this might be the best build i've ever done so i don't want to put too many leaves even though i would love to all right and there we go i didn't add too many leaves but i think it looks a lot better with the leaves added and i also went around to add leaves all around my dock and i added some on the pillar so it looks like it's growing into the water and last but not least let's light up the dock so no moss will spawn around here and there we go the entire dock is complete and now i have four blue axolotls the rarest mob in 1.17 minecraft but anyways guys i hope you guys enjoyed that episode this episode took a very long time to make it took me so many days to find those three axolotls but i really hope you guys enjoyed please smash the like button if you guys did comment down below share the video with a friend and if you guys want to watch the entire series starting off with episode one it'll be the first link in the description but please subscribe if you guys are new and i'll see you guys in the next episode on saturday see you guys later